Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Today we are in beautiful Southern California and behind me is an absolutely breathtaking European style home. Below, right here to our left actually, we've got a subterranean 15 car garage, but we'll get to that in a second. This home is sitting on a 15,000 square foot lot. We're at the end of the cul-de-sac here. We're on a corner property. This has got breathtaking views looking south and north towards Orange County, LA. You can see all up the coast, you've got views of Catalina. This house is currently on the market for an asking price of $10,750,000. It's got a total of six beds, eight bathrooms, and let's just go in the house. Let's take a tour. Guys, check this out. proper door open up you walk straight into your foyer look at this chandelier dropping down from the second floor with this art piece right above it wow because that's a nice feature but to the right when you come in the entrance you've got a really nice sized office here i can totally mount myself right here just freaking editing videos and everything and then let's head back across the hallway here we've got this beautiful marble staircase taking up to the second floor your master bedroom a couple other rooms up there. We'll show you that in a second, but let's take a look over here on the left. Here you have this sort of grand room, hangout space with these windows just wrapping around here. When you open this all up, it becomes flush with the outside. Inside you get this perfect sort of like, I don't, it's a vibe. It's a vibe, it's as simple as that. There's no obstructed views here and you're super private. Being on this corner lot, there's no one that can look in to your house. I mean, there's a couple houses way over there, but they can't see anything because they're too far. We're on the corner. so. Hangout space, come through here. Another staircase for quick access to upstairs rooms. And then here you go downstairs to the garage and movie theater right here. And then actually, go look at the kitchen, we'll get to it in a oh, second. Oh, sorry. But right here is an elevator. And you can look at yourself. Okay, let's take the elevator up to the next floor. All right. But first, let's show you guys the kitchen. You walk in, there's so much natural light, and I love all of the white wood cabinets here with this sort of brushed finish. And you've got your full Sub-Zero giant freezer fridge. This is like your coffee spot. This is where you come in, you got your microwave, you know, your food real quick, coffee in the morning, turn around, you've got ocean views, light coming in, it feels warm, it feels inviting, it feels open. And obviously, a kitchen would be complete without your SpongeBob pineapple house for your dog, which isn't here today, unfortunately, but I wish he was, because I love dogs. And then, I mean, I didn't touch on just how massive this island right here in the center of the kitchen is. You have a sink here, wolf appliances over here, six burner top with the griddle. You have two ovens down here, which I love when there's two ovens. And then, what happened? Yo, oh, sorry. Do you want, um, what is this? I don't know. They're like little candies. You oh, warheads? Yeah. Oh my God, I haven't had a warhead in so long. Okay, okay. If I have this now, I actually don't think I'll be able to talk. Oh. Like, Preston, this is, let's do it. You know what? At the end of the video, Preston, you're eating one too. We're both eating one. All right. We'll do it at the end though. Okay. Now, I'll take you guys outside, show you the backyard. This is, wait, where does this window? Ah, so this window lets some natural light into the stairwell right here when you're going downstairs. I like that. Wow. That's pretty cool. You have these massive cement poured columns here. Honestly, it's just so quiet in this neighborhood. And you've got just ocean all around you. It's such a fast elevation climb to get up here that it almost feels like you're sitting on top of the ocean. Yeah. It's a really cool feeling. And I'm so happy that we have glass all around this because it's actually just a big cliff on the other side. And I do not want to fall off it. Your pool, your built-in hot tub over here, more lounge seating. Press, you have to come over here and look at the house right now with this light. This looks stunning. You guys can see how we're on the corner right here. There's no neighbors. You've got the house. This looks spectacular. Let me get out of the way. Just, just show the house because it's just so cool. All right, so we can continue over here. And the agent, Quentin, was telling me that there's not a lot of homes in the neighborhood with such a big lot. And this house has got probably one of the biggest backyards in the entire neighborhood. And I don't want to run through the grass. I don't want to get wet because I think I saw the sprinklers on earlier. But this is so much room to hang out with the kids, let them run around. And obviously it gets hot, jump in the, jump in the pool. Mm -hmm. 
I love how you have so many ways to interpret the backyard space here. You can do so many different things. Let's go upstairs now, show you guys the master, which has probably the best views. Let's go up there right now and let's take the elevator, because why not? All right, let's do it. There. Show, show everyone in the mirror behind us what you have to carry when you film. Hey, what's going on, guys? Okay, close this. And then three, please. Wow. So you guys are really getting the full tour. We're showing you guys the elevator works. Wow. Open this. It takes you right up to the top of these stairs that we just showed you guys. And then through here, we have a shared bathroom. You could call it more of like a bedroom or another office space up here. You can really do whatever you want with it. Just walk straight through the balcony because between this and the master bedroom, this terrace has to have some of the best views I've seen in all of the Grinnegel. There's glare right here, but you can see just all the way around. You can see right down, I can see the stand on the beach, and then all the way south, you can see the Ritz Carlton Hotel. You see Monarch Beach Golf Club, of course, a few strands, and it's all pretty beach right here. And behind that cliff is actually where the Dana Point Harbor is. So in terms of location, it's pretty hard to make life get any better than this. So should we show them the garage? Should we show them the garage? Yeah. First, we have to show them the master bedroom. It's sort of there. Right. Press some papers. Yeah, let's do it. Grand review. Let's go. Yes. I mean, I'm speechless right now. You can open both of these up, and again, you have a even bigger terrace here to come out and enjoy the views. Then you have another beautiful sort of skylight painting above your bed. But again, it's so private in here. Okay, um, you've got his and her sinks, another vanity right here, and then this tub is sick. And then what is this in here? It's a sauna. This is, oh wow, wow. This is a super nice little shower in here. I like how it's tucked away in here though, Preston, because if you're showering, you come out, you can still dry off in this little like hallway, I guess, corridor, and mm -hmm. you're not gonna get any water all over the floor of your bathroom. And then we won't show the closet to everyone because there's some of the homeowner stuff in there, but you've got one side could be his, one side could be hers. So let's go back out right here. And you have this green overhang. There's another bedroom in there. And then you have your washer, dryer, laundry room in here. It's a nice deep sink and a bunch of little cavity throughout. Another bedroom with a really good sized walk-in closet here. I love the shelves. And then you have, again, views of the ocean. And here you get a nice giant mirror and a really cool walk-in shower right here. In here, last bedroom. And then she has her own balcony right there. And then another nice shower, giant mirror again. Medicine cabinet. Can we show them the garage now? Yeah. You want to go to the garage? Yeah, I want okay. to show them the garage. Let's go to the garage. It has a cool theater, Last, too. Can we get a view down of this? Beautiful. Let's take you guys inside, show you guys the garage slash movie theater. This is massive. And it doesn't stop at this wall, either. You turn right in here, there's your movie theater, there's your stairs to go upstairs, and the door to the elevator. But then you've got more room, you could fit more cars back in here. More, maybe your toys can go here and your cars can go over there, keep it separated. But right now they've got it set up as a gym for them. And then, oh, I didn't even notice these right here. That's pretty cool. So you can get some more natural airflow through here. If you've got cars starting with exhaust, you can get these doors or these windows open and sort of create a vacuum to get all the, you know, fumes out. Well, that's a cool Shelby clock, Shelby Cobra, for anyone that knows that car. Oh, there's a photo of one right here. Look at this, drag racing with the parachute at the back. Probably one of my favorite cars of all time. But, okay, so now we know the homeowner was super cool. Let's go check out the movie theater. And then behind you actually, before we get into that, your wet dry bar, your snacks, microwave, everything. There's another bathroom back here. Bathroom, another access point. What is this door? I'm assuming storage. Oh. 
It's an alley. Okay. Preston's favorite, Frozen, is playing. Let's turn this down, actually. <laughs> All right. This is a really good size screen in here for this house. And I guess you can open up more natural lights because they've got windows down here. That's a really cool feature they thought of when building this to actually get some natural light to the bottom level. Thank you so much for the listening agent, Quentin Pretty, for letting us into this home, taking a tour of it today. I hope you guys enjoyed the entire video and thank you for making it through all the way to this. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out more of our content. We're filming four more videos this week. So we're gonna have videos, videos, videos coming your way. And we're in Laguna Gale, California, signing out and we'll see you guys in the next video. Let's get this shit.